Hey everyone, um, it's a pleasure to be here. Um, I'll be completely honest with you. <laughs> when I received the invitation um, for this opportunity, um, I almost respectfully declined because I, um, I thought to myself, I'm just getting started. <laughs> you know, I don't, I don't have anything yet to say. <laughs> um, but um, even though I'm not, I'm not satisfied with, with where I am, I am, I'm satisfied with how far I've come. And I think being able to bring that back to the campus and, and encourage other students to, to continue to strive for that um, is, uh, was, was well worth it. Um, and I, I gather that that's why I'm, I'm here today. When I, um, when I walked around on the campus, I, I see so many, so many places where I've had um, life-changing, uh, very happy moments. Walking past um, Henry Hall, that's where I got uh, the, the notice um, that I had passed the first part of the Foreign Service Officer Test the very first time I took it. And I was, I was floating, floating back to, to my dorm on a cloud. I was, I was so excited um, knowing that I had I'd really taken the first step to become a Foreign Service Officer uh, with the State Department. I'm still working towards that, but I'm working on it. <laughs> um, and, uh, in the, in the library, now, now it's uh, in Ministry of Office, I believe, Zumberg, <laughs> um, sitting, you know, sitting at my computer and receiving an email that, uh, that I was invited to work at the U.S. Embassy in Vienna. Um, and I remember I was tearing up and all the students around me, they're probably wondering, whoa, she just got some really bad news. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> I was just so excited knowing that, um, that my life was going to change. Um, so in, in some instances, um, Grand Valley introduced me to these opportunities. Um, I received my Lebanon uh, fellowship to, to study abroad there for, for 10 days, um, thanks to the Model Arab League program, um, which Professor Amala uh, led me to, to get involved with, um, which was a fantastic opportunity. Um, I also have to thank the, the fellowship's office for, um, for constantly pushing on these, um, these invitations to come visit them, uh, which led me to become a Truman Scholar finalist. And, uh, Grand Valley did a remarkable job of preparing me for, for that outstanding opportunity uh, with practice, practice interviews and um, a board full of my, of my professors who uh, asked me some very tough questions that prepared me for the, for the, real, for the real deal. Um, even with the, uh, the interfaith understanding uh, event that took place led me to, to promote interfaith understanding as my platform when I decided to, to step out of my comfort zone and apply for uh, Miss Grand Valley. <laughs> I, I received um, second runner-up too, so <laughs> that was a pleasant surprise. <laughs> so in other instances, um, Grand Valley has, has helped me also push my boundaries and supported me in times when I've had to be um, resourceful and uh, do a little digging of my own for opportunities, but they've always had my back. The, um, uh, my professors, um, they have given me great advice and great support when I need to, uh, when I need to ask them about, well, you know, what exactly, where should I go um, for my study abroad and um, how exactly should I craft my, my application. Um, could they write me yet another cover letter <laughs> or another rec letter of recommendation? <laughs> um, and um, so I have, I have also learned to, to make my own luck uh, while I'm here um, by continuously seeking out opportunities. Um, and that, that is something that I've taken away from, uh, from my education here. Um, so as, as um, was, was said, I, I've carried this on with me and so I'll be teaching Arabic at a community center because I need to keep studying Arabic and there's, there's nobody to practice with. So I'm hoping that by teaching you know, some of my, um, my neighborhood, uh, I will be able to, to grow that community. Um, so I, I really need to thank uh, my professors for all of their advice and support that they've given me. Um, I need to thank my family's support. <laughs> um, driving to the airport, I, my dad did not turn around, but he urged me not to go to Lebanon. <laughs> but I went and I had a fantastic time. And I need to thank um, Grand Valley overall for, for just giving me such a wonderful environment to thrive here um, and have so many opportunities and clubs to get involved with and explore. Um, it was an, an investment of four years of my time and money and it, it has been so apparent, me, apparent to me how much they've invested back in my future. Um, and, uh, and for that, I'm so grateful. Go Lakers. 